Morning family, beautiful family. Um, so I have a I have a dream that I, I need to share with you. It happened a couple of weeks ago now. Um, I just want to quickly praise Heavenly Father. I just praise you, praise you, as you pour out your gifts and, and on us, on your children. You pour out dreams and visions, Father. It's all about glorifying you, sharing with the body, so that we can be. Um, we can be equipped and, and prepared for what is coming and so father and again if anything was not from you father I would just pray that you shut, shut down this video but I know you said my sheep know my voice and I heard you on waking I heard your voice um, so I'm just gonna yeah I ask you Lord to get this video out to the people and to what yeah to share it amongst your people Lord to prepare us all so thank you we, we just ask all this in Jesus name so uh, yeah family <laughs> family i have a dream a warning dream and i'll get straight to it okay so in this dream it's starting to go dark but it's not really dark enough for stars because there was one star in particular and i thought oh that's strange because there was no other stars in the sky and it wasn't really that dark but it was going dark and i'm looking i'm with somebody and I'm looking at this star and then all of a sudden it gets brighter and brighter and then I think it's a shooting star and then I think oh, it's coming right at me it's a meteorite and then it was all you know like split second thinking um, and then I, I went to push my friend out of the way uh, well first I saw a chariot I saw horses and I saw a demon and so this star turned into a chariot with a demon riding on the back of it and it was coming right at us. And I went to push my friend that was right next to me out of the way. And I remember it was it was about two yards away, which in split seconds, I thought that was weird. But um, as it passed through where we were stood, because I moved quickly, as did my friend, I said to my friend, I says, we had to move. I says, that was pure evil. If, if, if that had passed through us, we would have felt everything it's feeling. All the anger, everything that thing is feeling, we would have felt. And then, what I want to say is that this thing had passed through. It was going somewhere at a destination. It was, it was, it was traveling at such a speed. It was, boom, boom, and it was gone. Yeah, boom, boom, gone. Okay. So then, I wandered over the path over over the uh, road. Sorry, and I noticed that there was um, a carcass of, of a chariot, if you like. It just. Uh, like a, a wooden chariot but it was empty there was no horses nothing on it and it was, was pulled out outside of this i don't know hotel or a building i don't know where it was but i did notice as i just one minute i did notice i did notice as i i'm just walking dogs um i went to look at it i saw like four strands of i would say leather but not le not leather that i've ever seen before it was so beautiful. It was like different, two different shades of colour, but it was, uh, it wasn't shining gold, but it was like gold and I don't know how to explain it. It was something that I'd never seen before. And uh, it was obviously where four bands of this, so I imagine that four, four demons would be crouched down and holding on to that. So on these chariots, on these chariots, um, there's more than one demon coming in but it was I think the message on that one was the material they are bringing in materials that we don't know but but it was so beautiful I went wow and then I, I couldn't even touch it because I knew it was evil I knew it was evil but boy it was beautiful so um yeah what else was there in that dream so when I woke um I believe fallen angel because uh, it started off as a star. There's some, you know, um, there's something in 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 the Bible that talks about refers to angels as stars and stars as angels. So I just just feel how God speaks to me. In waking, I heard heard the Lord say, "In the end days, um, the love of most will grow cold." So the scripture um, that I I looked up was. Um, um, as lawlessness abounds the love of most will wax cold um, but I have to say it to you as the Lord gave it me it was in the end days 
in the end days, the love of Mars will grow cold. If these things are flying around and, and they can even affect the body of Christ, how much more are they affecting um, the, uh, the non-believers? So, you know, there is a storm coming. We know that, we can feel it. We just have to really stay under the, under the shadow of the Almighty, get under his wings and just, just stay with him. I'm going to release this anyway because um, I've got something else I need to share soon. Um, God bless you all and just peace be with you and stay focused on, on our King. Um, yeah, okay. Bye for now.